So let's go in the uh, aquifer direction. Not too far away. Here it is. Here we have the aquifer booth. Uh, we share the space with Yon Marine Life, Gruenman's Aquarium. And uh, let me show you the vertical display of PETA. This is a vertical display where we expose our plants. They still keep in a hydroponic way, the same way as we keep it in a greenhouse. As you see, time to time the sprinklers here, they spray some water. Um, I set it here to spray water every three hours for 10, 50 seconds. You see all the plants look quite nice and these plants came from the nursery or from our greenhouse on uh, they were packed on uh, last Wednesday so today is Monday and you see how they look like this area there is also a submerged area where we can put some submerged plants in case you need but uh, mainly there is uh, more space for the immersed ones because in our assortment we have more immersed plants than submerged um, beta has these systems in i think in 60 120 and uh, 180 or two meters i think they can make it with the size uh, you need to expose or to keep and storage the plants aquatic plants in your shop then uh, in this side we have esther hello esther good morning, good morning. and frank hello, from ruinman's and let me show you the small display tanks with some fish, some handler guppies, quite nice over here, some uh, red sakura shrimps, and uh, some beta, some females. They look really nice over here. Let's try to get this on focus. We have the Psidomogil Gertrudei. I love this fish, very active also colorful maybe i will give it a try again in my tanks at home then here we have the nanostromos i think is the marginatos they are really amazing the colors on it the red wow it's a pity there is not too much light the guys are quite curious let's see if they are coming no nope. But I have at home the Nostromos uh, back 40 and these ones I think is the Marginato, they have more intense color. You see for the red stripe on the, on the, in between the lines, yes, this is just amazing. Also some, uh, I believe, could be some live food for some fish, I guess. And uh, now let's take a look to the tank. I think you guys already know this one, it is 120 by 60 by 50. You guys know this tank, this tank was kept at Agua Flora a long time ago and prepared initially for um, the Bebo. Afterwards we are going to take this to Vivarium but then we had a small issue with the tank and we brought it back now to a needle. If I'm not wrong, this tank has uh, it did already one year since it was escaped. Uh, not sure yet what we're going to do with this one afterwards, but so far uh, we're going to keep it. Maybe it will be a nice tank just to take also to Winter Zoo. In this tank we have a lot of mix of stem plants from Rutala rotundifolia, uh, Rutala yaohai, uh, Rutala H. ara, Let's see from this side, probably you can get a better look of all the stem plants here. Rotala Fulifolia, Yaohai, uh, H. Ara, Orange Juice from the top. Also, you can have a look to all the stem plants over here. We have also here Christmas moss, some Bobitis Ulotti. Some Rotala green on the side. The carpet <laughs> is Liliopsis new Nova Zelandae. You see that it's very tiny. Eh? After two or three trimmings, it becomes like this, very small. So, uh, right. in the front we have Eriocalum SP. 
Also, some Anubis Barteri Nana, Nana Mini, Mini Mini, uh, pretty sure there's some Pangolino, there is some Bustolander Lemandal Mini Red, uh, some Micantro Micantromoids, uh, another again Bustolander Lemandal Mini Red, and see over here. Uh, try to get a uh, general view of this layout. And uh, of course, not forget to mention the light ground uh, from a Polish company called the light ground. is a uh, background illuminated, you can dim. It's made by the light ground company in Poland. Sure, no problem. And this is it guys, I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, I don't have that much more to show. Uh, we will come back to Viva, uh, to Aquaflora, to Vikven in uh, today. So I will have a lot of maintenance over there. Uh, maybe a few new tanks that I need to escape. And probably I will record a few more videos and show it to you later. So I hope you have enjoyed it and see you in the next video. Take care.